It's a new approach to weight loss and diabetes prevention, a pill that contains super strains of good bacteria to combat disease. Sydney researchers are currently trialling the pill on dozens of people in the hope it can help stem the obesity epidemic. 64-year-old Peter Mays has been taking the trial capsules every day before breakfast and dinner in the hope he can lose some weight. I'm keeping quite active and doing things, but the, the weight keeps just piling on. His weight ballooned from 80 to 100 kilos in the past few years. I did weigh a lot less than I weigh now until I couldn't do much more sport because of my bad knees. Professor Ian Caterson from Royal Prince Alfred Hospital says there's more to losing weight than just diet and exercise. The health of our gut plays an important role. Some years ago we showed that people who lost weight got a certain pattern of bugs in their gut. So, by injecting healthy colonies of bacteria back into the gut, it could potentially promote weight loss and stave off type 2 diabetes. The new capsule contains eight strains of potent bacteria, 50 billion in all. The strains chosen after a careful review of the scientific literature. We're the first to gather all the best available knowledge together in one capsule. A product like this is not in the market. We have a high dose in a multi-strain probiotic. There are three times more bacteria living in our gut than the cells we have in our body. This might come as a shock, but this is what two and a half kilos of fat looks like. Peter's goal is to lose at least four of these. I'd be happy to lose 10 kilos or ideally 20. The University of Sydney's Charles Perkins Centre, which boasts a range of technology for taking body measurements, is still recruiting volunteers. Gabriella Rogers, Nine News. The American dentist who sparked global outrage.